and action. Hello, I'm John Anderson. Um, we're going to show you a demonstration on how to irrigate an NG tube. This demonstration is not intended to be a study aid for your lab testing. For questions uh, regarding lab testing, please consult your critical elements. So today we're going to do NG irrigation. Uh, our patient here, Mr. Lower Jaw, already has uh, his NG placed, uh, but it's clogged up with something and uh, the doctor has ordered that we irrigate it until clear. So the supplies that we're going to need for this demonstration are gloves, um, a bottle of normal saline irrigation, a medicine cup, a sterile um, specimen cup, pH paper, you can um, use a uh, pink emesis basin, and then you're also going to need a um, a kit, an irrigation kit, which comes with the, the pistol and um, a measuring device here. Okay. All right. So the first thing that I do is I wash my hands and I check the well check the orders and make sure that's what we do. Then I'm going to put some gloves on. Clean gloves. This is not a sterile procedure. And then I'm going to take my normal saline and I'm going to fill up my uh, specimen cup. Now you need at least um, 70 or 80 mLs, um, so, but put in a, probably around 100 just to make sure that you're getting enough. And then put that on your bedside table next to you. Then what we need to do is um, we have our pistol and mortar still here. I'm going to put that here too. Now the first thing that we need to do is we need to check placement to make sure that we're in the right spot. The, way we, the ways that we do that, the best way is a chest x-ray. The next best way is to check um, the pH of the stomach contents. Um, so what I do is take a piece of pH paper, rip it off, and then I put it right in the medicine cup. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, aspirate some stomach contents and then put it right on here, and then I can compare it to the chart on here to make sure that I'm in the right spot. What we're looking for is something less than five. All right, so we have an empty pistol, and we're going to clamp this off, remove the plug, and we're going to aspirate about five or six mLs of stomach contents, clamp this off, and then I'm going to, I'm going to uh, squirt it right on the pH paper. And then I'm going to compare this number, or this pH paper, with the chart that's in here. You have to compare them, because otherwise how do you know what the number is? And the number that we're looking for is less than five. That um, means that we're in the right spot. And it is, it's about 4.3, so I know I'm in the right spot. Okay, so I'm gonna draw up 30 to 50 mLs of fluid. And then I'm going to instill it into the catheter. Then we're going to wait a second, and then we're going to try to draw it right back out again. Now, whatever I get out, I'm going to remember the number because I have to record that on my I's and O's. So this, I put in 60, or let's say I put in 30, and I got out 30. So let's get rid of that 30, put it in here, and then draw up um, 30 more. And then I'm going to aspirate it out. And now this time, I put in 30, but I got out uh, 60. So we're going to squirt it in there. And this, this is clear now. Uh, the drainage coming out is, is flowing pretty good, and there's no problem with that anymore. So now we can either put the patient back to a plug or hook them back up to the wall suction. So now we need to go back to our numbers. So we put in 30, and we got out 30. And then we put in 30 and we got out 60. So total, we put in 60 and got out 90. So on our I's and O's, we're going to put down plus 30 on the intake because we got out, or I'm sorry, under the output. We got out 30 more than we put in. Don't put down 60 and 90 because that's not the way it should be done. It should be just the difference between the two. In this case, we got out 30 more than we put in. All right? So once we do that, we can clean up our station here. 
um, and then take our gloves off, wash our hands, and then make sure the patient is comfortable. And that is a demonstration on how to um, irrigate an NG tube. Thank you.